Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Eternal Sonata. This is Moogle Master 102, and today we're gonna go to the LG of the Moon. Where would that you say? Where, where would that be you say? Well, it's through this portal, of course, because uh, we kind of created it. Well, actually, you know, Count Waltz and his goonie didn't, but uh, we gotta go ahead and pro uh, get on their tail. We gotta, we gotta go find them. So let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go through this. And I will shut up and let you guys watch the cutscene. Well, of course. Gotta go through this portal first. I'm surprised we didn't get hurt through a menacing portal like that. His power was so immense, he actually managed to rip a hole in space. We can't just leave things like this. Come on. We'd better go and find him. And here, we're in the town of the dead. And of course, we got we, we have two things that we could do here. Is go talk to, I think, the sister, which is above here. And we could do some shopping. But first, we're going to go ahead and go talk to the sister. Because um, I think that initiates something. So we're going to go ahead and do that. There you are. What do you got for us? What are you doing? Or, pfft, God damn it. Where are you going? That's already the top. That'll give the ghost soon. Why don't you let it do what it likes? Are you tired of sand? Has a stagnant wind dried you out? Time is meaningless here. Time makes time makes things rot. Do you still want to go? So you will still move time yourself? Very well. Then climb the Tower of Tribulation. Be tested by the one who can determine if you can truly sway time. I will pray for you. And yeah, so we're going to go ahead and do some shopping. Of course, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the video. Actually, yeah, we'll show we'll show what the this kind of stuff you can buy from here. We might as well. Hey, dude, what's going on? It's just ingrained in me, but even though I'm dead, I still want to sell things. Of course you do. But anyway, so we got lots of items here that we can buy. We also got some photos to sell. Which we have plenty of. Kind of worthless photos, but we'll get quite a bit of money. Um, so we have new items here. We got the Magnum Arm, we got the Lou, Lymphata, the Hectatomb, the Celestial Gloves. We got all kinds of stuff. So we're gonna we're gonna buy all these. We're gonna do this off screen just so that it doesn't take up too much time in the video. So I'll be right back. And we're back. Okay. So I went ahead and rearranged everybody's stuff. Of course, we're just going to keep the pocket watch and the werewolf choker on falsetto. And we're going to keep everything else just intact. Uh, we're also running Serenade in our party. If I hadn't already mentioned that. But Serenade is going to be our ace in the hole for this next dungeon coming up. So I figured I would go ahead and uh, let you guys know that. But for now, 
we're going to go ahead and go into the next dungeon, which is... Well, we're about to find out, of course. So let's go ahead and talk to this guy. This is the way to the Xylophone Tower. Those without, those without the Elder's permission shall not pass. Oh, well, where's the Elder? Well, I, 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 I can tell you guys. So, let's just go ahead and find him. Which, I mean... Without a doubt, he has to be in the oddest place imaginable. So we're gonna go. Here we are in the Noise Dunes Fantasy. So, we're in the Elder. Uh, well, you can see him from a faint distance, but that's the Elder over there. And we also got enemies. I don't know if they give much experience, but we can fight one just in case. We won't really need to, considering I already grinded off screen. So, I'm gonna go ahead and punch the shit out of this guy. Eh. That's not good. Ah, oh, crap. There we go. Son of a bitch! There we go. I'm really rusty at this game. I have not played it in a while. Of course, with all the recording done with... With all the, uh... Because I... I know for sure this video, this this LP is gonna be pretty much done from all this pre-recording session. So, because this was recorded a few days before the Christmas times, I want to wish you guys a very happy Christmas, if uh, or whatever year you or not year, whatever <laughs> holiday you guys celebrate, you guys have yourself a freaking awesome Christmas. Like I said, this is probably gonna be uploaded like after Christmas time. I don't know when I'm going to be able to uplo upload uh, any more videos. Just because I'm busier during Christmas time. So. So, yeah. Let's we'll just do this. Aha. Uh -huh. We learned that move not too long ago, which is a really useful move. Ah, oh, crap. That all missed? Are you serious? Wow. We got a lot of experience from that. It's always nice. Hey, dude. What's going on? Oh, you're the elder, huh? Hey, my brother. New guy. Welcome to the LG. Let's start things off with a handshake. Perder there. Er, right. Forgot. I don't have hands. Bravo. Bravo. You hit the new age of stupidity, Mr. Old Man. Anyway. Hey, you guys aren't even dead. What did you come to a place like this for? In other words, you all came you all came this way to the noise dunes just to chase a monster? I'll cut it right to the chase. It's impossible. Well just look at that barrier. How do you even expect to get anywhere if you can't get through that? How to break the seal. It's simple. You need to flip the deactivation switch on the top of the xylophone tower. But the monsters that hang out there are super tough. You might even die, man. Are you still gonna go? Hell yeah, we are. Well then, you got your heart set on climbing the tower. I have to give you my elder's permission. Alright, cool. I like that idea. Should have done that a while ago instead of hiding in the noise dunes. So let's go ahead and go to the xylophone tower then. Of course, I'm going to go ahead and seize this opportunity to be right back. Okay, and we are back. So what I'm actually going to do, and people are going to like, people are going to be surprised at this, but I'm actually not going to run viola on this team. 
I know what you're thinking. You're like, oh, he's not he's not running Viola on his team? Oh my god. No, there's a reason I'm doing this. Not only for challenge purposes, but because I want to spend a dungeon without having to use Viola. And she's a little bit over leveled. So I figured why not have everybody else have their chance to uh beat the shit out of anyways. So this is, we're the playstyle in this session is gonna be a little bit different. Of course, we got the elders' permission to go in the xylophone tower. Let's let's go do that. This way to the xylophone tower. Those without the elders' permission shall not pass. What? You have the elders' permission? Very well. You may pass. Oh, oh well. I would have just boot you out of the way anyway to let me in. All right, here we go. Alright, so here, we're in the Xylophone Tower. Now you're probably thinking, what's the gimmick of this dungeon? It couldn't possibly be just playing music to go to the next part of the stage. Well, yeah. But in this case, it's a game of Simon Says. So you gotta memorize what the um, notes are. It's not too hard, so we're gonna go ahead and do it. So have you noticed me, have you? I'm the guardian of this lofty tower. Are you now? Well, isn't this a treat? I haven't had visitors in quite some time. It seems that everyone's a coward these days. Nobody has the guts to take on this tower. I've got a soft spot for reckless little humans like you. Oh, do you now? Wait, what's at the blank stairs? You mean you don't know about the trial? Whoa, whoa. Hold on, seriously? Well, it seems like my little speech of praise was wasted on you. Which means, wait, don't tell me. You don't know the rules of the trial either. Unbelievable. Kids these days. I guess there's nothing to do for it. Alright. Or, I guess there's nothing for it. Alright, I'll explain the rules, so listen up and listen good. First, take a look over there at those golden keys. Uh, sir, hate to break it to you. Those are golden! I'm going to play you a song, and it's your job to memorize it. Hey, what's with all the frowning? There's nothing to worry about. While I'm playing the music, the keys glow and match the different notes. So even if you don't understand the music, you can memorize the order in which the lights glow. When the song's over, it's your turn. Play the notes in order you heard them. Here it goes. Stand on the key of the note you want to play and then press the X button. If you're standing on the correct key, the key will light up and the note will play. If you make a mistake, there will be no light and you'll hear no sound. If you manage to recreate the song entirely, I'll open up the stairway that leads to the next floor. Man, you're awesome. Well, do you think you've got it? Oh yeah, you're damn right, man. I actually, I actually memorized everything in here. I actually, I hate to say that, but I have a cheat sheet. But I'm gonna try and not use it. So, but we're we're gonna try and memorize it the best we can. Um, which I've already practiced on this in my practice file. So yeah. If you can't remember at all make and make a mistake, just come and talk to me. I'll let you hear the song again. Alright, here it goes. Listen up now. Okay. That's that's pretty easy. So it's it's Oh, excuse me. It's this and then G F G. Like that. It's pretty easy to remember. I think there's like f three of them. Let me see. Uh, I'm trying to remember. I think there's three. This is just on a sticky note too. It looks like it's three. Yeah. I like the music here too. It would have been cool if it had, like, played the title theme, 
of Eternal Sinnoh? That would be pretty awesome. Of course, we got enemies here we can always fight. The enemies here give okay experience. It's always good. Of course, this being said, I'm gonna go ahead and snowclaw you. Bam! Are you catching on yet? Uh, we'll just do this. Bam! Wow, a lot of damage right there. And we'll go ahead and Starlight Blast you. Starlight Blast is so good. I love it. Alrighty. Up more we go. You're gonna hear this a lot, by the way. Too much music and lights. It's so bright that I'm going blind. This is gonna be... This is gonna be quite a while. It's a long stairway. Hey, dude. You wanna fight? Oh, it's only one of you. I'm not that worried. Now, these enemies look cool. Really cool looking enemy. Oh, shit. Your hitbox is a little finicky, huh? Well, no problem. There we go. And I will go ahead and do this. It's not gonna kill you, but yeah. This guy hits hard, by the way. And we're just gonna Shadow Beam. Boom! That was a good fight. Such a cool looking move in slow motion. Ugh. Anybody else have that weird like itch in their nose? Where it's like the left nostril and you have to like keep squeezing your nose to scratch it? Without like initially just picking your nose in public, because who does that? It's disgusting. Room escape. That's always nice. I don't think I'll ever need it, but we have plenty. Because <laughs> we have plenty of those already. Alrighty. Trying to keep these episodes long instead of, like, super short. So you're probably going to be seeing a little bit shorter episodes from here on out. Which, not necessarily a bad thing. It gives more people to watch. Well, it gives more for people to watch, I would mean. Hopefully Harmony Chain will take care of this guy. There we go. Nice combo. Oops. Eh. It's always good to keep everybody nice, nice and healthy. Oh, wow. This guy hits hard. And we'll do this. Oh, I didn't equip any more items on you, I don't think. And a nice little Night Fist to finish you off. There we go. That was a good fight. Okay. Let me rearrange your items a little bit here. Defense and your speed. Okay. So you do have your defense and your speed on. Huh? I might actually say fuck the defense and give you the power ring. Hey, why the hell not? There we go. Look at that. 300 damage. Big difference right there. Alrighty. Now we'll go. I would have figured, you know, I mean, Algaretto's pretty powerful in, in himself. We also have a safe spot here, but we're not going to do that because we're men. And we're going to go ahead and uh, play more music. Of course, this one's a lot harder, so just keep that in mind. Alrighty. It appears you've noticed me, Guardian of this Hollow Tower. If you have come this far, that means you have c completed my younger brother's trial. Oh, your old brother's, huh? Oh, well, he's a rather simple fellow. 
This trail can be passed with ease, and you can manage to remain calm. You'll find, however, I am different. If you think such an easy task deserves to be called a trial, you would do well to think again. A trial is un... Un unsure mountable wall or insure mountable wall that's what we'll call it I don't know why I said unsure insure mountable wall a bitter struggle I, will, I shall send you home in tears oh yeah well then shall we begin my trial why not listen for I will play of course it has the beginning of the song so that's something to keep in mind. Okay, so we're gonna do the usual thing. We're gonna go B, G, F, G, and I think it's F again. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, I got it right. Okay, let's see. Eh, it, and then I think it's G C. G, C, I, I think, ah, damn it, I screwed it up big time, alright, we'll do this again, alright, G, F, G, F, okay, so E sharp, Oh, okay. High C. I, I forgot about high C. Okay. We'll do this again. And then... G, F, G, F, uh, E sharp, uh, B sharp, uh, G, C, and then high C. What? I made another error? Oh my god, I feel stupid. Okay. Let's do this again. Screw it up this time. I thought the no I th <laughs> I thought C flat was high C. What was I thinking? I am a dumbass. I know my music terms somewhat, so yeah, I'm a dumbass. I don't even I don't even know why I freaking thought that was a good idea. I don't think there's a chest over here. I don't think there's one over here either. No. Okay, so the xylophone. Stare away we go. Of course, the next trial is not going to be so easy, for it's really freaking long. But if you remember, if you remember that it carries on from the last song, you should have nothing to worry about. I just got to remember those two C's are the key factor in the next song. So yeah. Man, your hitbox is huge. Come on, let's go. I'm like kicking your ass again, though. Woo! Anything that gets in my way is going down. There we go. Well. What did you expect? And then up we go. Do 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 do. All the music. Ah, damn it. This isn't good. Yeah, walk into the darkness. 
shit. I meant to hit both of them, but oh well. The shadow of the flower falls on the vortex and knows no fear. Imperial spirit, night Huh, you're hopeless. I'm ready to take on the world. Sure, sure. What's causing... Hold on. Chance of slowing the enemy. Is there something that's causing you... I'm not imagining things, am I? Okay. I think you just probably got debuffed from the last enemy, because I saw a debuff on Falsetto, so... Aw, oh, man! Yeah, of course. You got a massive hitbox. Oh, <laughs> He, he fucking bitch smacked me. Luckily, he's dead. There's no way he's living a no claw and a shadow beam. Or night fist. Whatever works. Alright, we're gonna go this way. This is some chests we can pick up. No, go away. I want to fight you. Nothing over here? Oh. Son of a bitch. The minute it sees me, it just it speeds up. It goes in the full power mode. Yeah. Wow, that thing just ate it. Shall we go then? That's, that's like three hits from the last hit, too. Holy crap. Ruthless. Weapon for Salsa. It's always nice. I'm just gonna continue to go up. Hey! Another one. Alice's Watch. If you don't already... Oh, this is it. Alice's Watch. We don't really need it, but... You can uh, increase your tactical time. So, I don't think I'm going to use it all that much. We don't really need it, so. Alright, let's go to our next trial. Uh, yeah, let's go. This one's not going to be easy, I can tell you that. If you remember the harmony from the last one, which I do, somewhat. Oh, shit, I wasn't reading the text. Word of caution. Be at ease. It's nothing to of it's nothing of great import. It is only that here the keys will not light as as they did in the lower floors. Oh isn't that simple? Shall we get going? Which means you have to remember it without the keys lighting up. Which is which which sucks. Okay, so Yeah. Okay, the the ones the, the 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 lights only light up when it's like the last part of the song, if you remember. So we're gonna do our usual thing, which is uh, B sharp, and then G, F, G. Um, it was e, it was E sharp again, I think, right? It was E sharp. W what? I pressed it. That's that's dirty game. I do not press E. Oh, I may, I may have forgotten to press F again. Okay. Let's try this again. And then... G... F... G... F... And then I think it's E sharp... And then B sharp again. And then G, C, and then the high C, and then G again. Uh, 
Uh, high B sharp, and then high A sharp, if I'm correct. Ah, oh, yeah, we did it. Yeah. We did it. We did it. Not that hard of a dungeon. Let's go up now. I think that's the last of the hard dungeons, <laughs> pretty much. All you have to do now is deal with the freaking annoying boss. Yeah, that's right. We have a boss. Of course, we gotta go up this stairway. So we'll just continue going up. Up, 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 up. Yeah, there's two of them this time. Whoa! Yo, he just Sonic fisted me. What, you think this is Persona now? Ow. Alright. And then a nice Shadow Beam. Maybe Night Fist if we get lucky. Bam! Aw, oh, you son of a bitch. Uh-oh. Ow. If you strike a stone, rocks are scattered. If you strike a person, the soul is scattered. Death to pulse! Shut up, Bean! And this will kill you. Bye bye. That was perfect. Damn, that's a lot of experience from that too. Ah, damn it. Two of you again, right? Yeah. Whoa. No, sir. Actually, that's not too bad for experience. Ha! Ah, you've been slowed. This will be nice to do. Nice heal for everyone. Oops. I didn't harm any chain. This is gonna hurt like a bitch, though. That starlight blast. Oh god. Oh, look at him. He's backing off. He doesn't want to fight anymore. Oh my god. Still alive? Bam! And bam. There you go. What did you think? Man, Falsetto, he's got one more level. Until she's at level 40. First character to reach level 40 wins. Alright. Take one more enemy and we'll be good. Yeah. Let's go. Come on, let's go! Show me what you've got! Oh, there's a lot of editing in this episode, but I don't really mind. It's just the nature of it. Bam! This is the power of man. Feel the wrath of my staff. Oh wow, that did no damage. I never seen that before. <laughs> it's news to me. Of course, we'll go to Starlight last. That didn't kill you either. What baloney? Uh oh. Ow. Huh. 
Howling Thunder. Let's go. Ooh. Double kill. Oh. Serenade leveled up. Very nice. Phoenix Rising as well. Very nice. That's how I like it. Phoenix Rising and Light Attack, if, I, if I'm correct. Go ahead and heal up here. Phoenix Rising is indeed a attack. That. A light attack. Which is actually a little bit better than Shadow Beam. Mostly just because it's a nice hard knockdown. And I like me some uh, hard, hard knockdowns. Oh, wait. We just missed a chest. I'm going to go grab that. Of course, this enemy just has to be in the way. Because it just wants to fight so bad. Get out of here. And damn. Didn't kill him. No, sir. I'm gonna go straight for you. Bam! There we go. That'll take care of you. I love Phoenix Rising. It is such a good hard knockdown move. As much as I love Shadow Beam, I feel Phoenix Rising. Phoenix Rising. <laughs> Phoenix Rising is a lot more uh, better, just because the hard knockdown is really, really nice. And of course, we get Nidhogg's Fang, which is a very nice weapon for Algaretto. Which I think is actually his one of his best weapons. Chance of poisoning an enemy. Which is better than the one that you would get in... What is it? The... Whatchamacallit? Uh, Fort Fermata. I believe. Really good weapon. We're, we're most likely going to be using, the, using it a lot. So, it's always nice. What we're going to do now is we're just going to heal up our characters. Just a little tiny bit. Oh, I... You know what? I'm not even going to do that. We're not going to use the Clover. We're just going to do this. We're going to go ahead and save our game. Might as well. We're done this Xylophone Tower. Man, this, this recording session went a lot better than I expected. But it's also because I kind of cheated. Because I had a cheat sheet that I could almost barely read. Because my handwriting is terrible. Um, I played it by memory while kind of glancing at it a little bit. So... I didn't really, like, I didn't really, I, I guess, I don't know, I guess I didn't cheat that much. I guess if you want to put it that way. Whatever. Alright, anyway, let's go ahead and fight the boss. So these guys are the sentries of the tower, huh? Let's go! Alright, so one thing I want to point out. That shrub is a fucking asshole. Take out, take care of it. Just don't... I... Thought I... I... Thought I had it. I guess I didn't. So what we're gonna do... We're gonna just do this. Have Serenade do her usual thing and stay out of danger. While we go ahead and beat the ever living shit out of this guy. Man, my guarding is off today. And we're gonna Howling fun th Thunder after this. Yeah, look at that damage we already freaking pumped in him. Excuse me. 
I'm not too worried about Falsetto dying because I have plenty of Angel Trumpets. Thirty-two, yeah. You are so dead. As I've said before, I'm not too worried about her dying. As long as you don't get poisoned. Uh, Angel Trumpet? Why not? And we will go ahead. Yes. God damn it. Ah. No, you son of a bitch. Might as well do this. Alright. Oh, my dear God. The shrub, though. Oh, my... Wow, he missed his attack. I got really lucky there. Okay. Now, take care of this asshole. For good. I'm gonna lay waste your fucking asshole. See you later. Oh, you're still alive. Oh. I'm just gonna heal up just a little bit here. A nice Starlight Blast might do something, though. Oh my god, how much health do you have? Seal off. Not that much damage. Oh well. What can you do? Man, without Viola, this fight's actually kind of tough. Bring them behind. Son of a bitch. Come on. Don't guard me. Don't be a douche. Now you're definitely dead. There. And we'll heal up. Perfect. And you might be dead here too. There. Bye bye. <laughs> Man. Right on. That was insane. It's also thanks to Serenade, too. So that's the seal. Then we can break the barrier. Now we can move on to the final dungeon.
You know, with that being said, as we lowered the barrier, and we're pretty much just pooped out from this entire session, I will see you guys next time for another episode of Eternal Sonata, where we will go ahead and go through the noise dunes. Dunes? Dunes? We will go through the noise dunes to the final dungeon. See you guys next time.